How's it going guys? Welcome to a brand new video. So tonight we have come to the infamous Ancient Ram Inn. Tonight we're joining our friends over at Ghost Quest who you guys will see shortly. But right now me and David are inside the Ancient Ram Inn completely alone. Already had a strange experience when we were just coming to check the place out. And uh, yeah, it's been four years. Four years since our last investigation here. And a lot of you guys that follow us and been on the channel for quite a few years will know that I had one of the, well, all of us really, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Had one of the scariest experiences we've ever encountered in this place. And it was back way before we uh, showed our investigations to anyone and did anything public. Uh, this was going way back, uh, back when um, John used to live here and that and yeah. Basically, my mum came with us that night. She was down here in the room where we're doing the intro. And I told her before we came here, because obviously the history of the place with demons and negative energy and just everything about it is dark. I said to her, whatever you do, don't antagonize, don't wind it up, don't call it out, just investigate, ask normal questions and we'll see what happens. We'd gone upstairs, didn't we? Yeah. And she stayed down here on her own. Mm -hmm. And she was basically sitting here going, come on then, show me what you can do, bring it on. I don't believe you can do anything. Like, come and do something to me, blah, blah, blah. We had zero activity for the entire night until we was in the bishop's room early hours of the morning. And all of a sudden, something went for my mum. Uh, she started making these weird noises, which turned into growls. She was then flung onto a bed backwards, um, just going absolutely crazy. Like her eyes weren't her eyes. It was just horrible, wasn't it? Um, it was. We did film it, but the, on a very old uh, the camera as well. The tape on the old camera has gone missing. All the other tapes are there. Yeah. That one was missing. Yeah, and it took us actually seven years. It took us to actually come back here and actually get the courage to come back here and investigate obviously would not step foot in his place in my mum um but yeah we did come back here after seven years and uh i don't know i just, I just i've always had a strange thing about this place yeah, there's always it's... something off of it i don't know um but yeah the the last time I was here was four years ago um and that was a strange one wasn't it strange yeah. so we had those um... I was actually talking about my mum in the bishop's room on that one. Yeah. So when we had those uh, weird laughs and stuff, like someone was mocking me. Yeah. Was it when I was in the chair and that there was a young child? I don't. It might have been. And then I sort of uh, lost control of my mind. Yeah. <laughs> I have anyway, but no. What I'm saying is, I, I was, it it was like I was moving away from myself. Yeah. Strange feeling, but if you watch the video, um, you'll see what uh, see what I mean. It, this place is so yeah. dark. And How do you feel like being back here now? Uh, as soon as I walk through the door, I'm like I'm struggling to breathe a little bit. I'm not breathing normally, just struggling to breathe, and my head's getting a bit heavy yeah I don't know I don't know if I'm bringing it on myself because I'm a little bit apprehensive but mm. I don't know let's Weird see what going, happens eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah so I just feel very heavy um, I felt on edge all day before we even got here just waking up this morning and knowing that we're coming back here um, I've been on edge, just didn't feel right. Um, even just walking over to it a minute ago. Should we just see quickly why we're in here on our own? Yeah, let's just see if we've got anybody let's have a look. willing to say anything. Right. Are you ready? Yeah. Is there anybody here with me and David right now? Tell us what, what you think of us. Oh, 
Are you going to join us later? Do you remember my mum? What happened to my mum? Should give that a quick listen back. This is David. Is there anybody here with me and David okay. right now? Don't tell us what, what you think of us. Are you going to join us right now? Don't tell us what, what you think of us. David. Flipping out, David. It says your name. Right now? It said David. Damn, <gasps> like a, it was a whispery. <laughs> So here with Ben from Ghost Quest. How are we doing guys? Good to see you again. All right, you? Yeah, good are you? Yeah, yeah. It's been a long time since we've seen yeah, each other, yeah. isn't it? I know. Um, Edin Revolts. Edin Revolts. Six, six, seven six, years ago, wasn't it? Seven years. Oh, it's yeah. gone flowing, hasn't it? Absolutely flowing. Absolutely. I ain't taking you a bit, have I? <laughs> <laughs> I think I am. Just a little bit. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm looking forward to this place again. Yeah, it's, it, I'm really pleased that you could both come and, oh, like I say, I think together. You're very welcome. I think together we can get some really good activity between us. Um, yeah. It's like I say, this place when we were last here was insanely active. Yeah. Um, not the last time, sorry, the time before the last time, um, and it just was relentless all night. We it never stopped, and the second time we came, which was a few months, six months ago now, um, it was complete opposite. It was we struggled to get anything. Yeah. So we've had to come back to try and see if we can actually finish our episode off because. You know, not a lot. We didn't really get a lot, so that yeah. we're aware of. We haven't reviewed it yet, but we've had the same, haven't we? Like we've been before, and we've had like no activity at all, and then like we'll have one big thing happen, and then it will just die down again. Yeah. yeah. Or then you can come another time, and it's just like one thing after another. Mm. But we've been filming here, haven't we, for an hour or so now, and you've actually experienced something already, haven't you? Because we were yeah, here yeah. filming. Yeah, we've even caught a couple of EVPs as well. One yeah. sounds like it says David's name. Really? Uh, which was wow. in the bar area as well. Yeah. You seem to get called out, don't you? A lot of locations. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. Something's happening already to yeah. that. Because obviously, while we were filming in here, you guys were outside and you came in and said, did you switch that light off upstairs? Because yeah. when we went up for the walk around earlier, yeah, you switched all I switched the... the lights on. And then you could see the basement from outside and you said, did you go and switch it off? I said, no, yeah. I've, I've literally been in here filming and we haven't even been upstairs since. And the light was yeah. off, wasn't it? And then it came back on. It came back on, yeah. yeah. It's still on now, I think, as well. That'll be interesting. So and something's aware that we're all here, isn't it? You both saw something as well, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We saw something, yeah. yeah. Go past the window quite, quite quickly. It was like a slim shadow. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what you've seen, but it was yeah, similar. Yeah, no, so we were, we were filming one of our team's interviews uh, just in here. Um, we just wrapped it and we, I walked outside and... Um, I looked up just, just out of intuition straight at the attic window and then I saw some kind of grey sh shadowy figure white past it. Um, now I'm quite sceptical about all these things, you know, we were in here with some bright lights and there was a bright light in my eyes, you know, I'm thinking you've gone from a really bright room to a dark darkness outside so it could be your eyes adjusting, but yeah. it was pretty distinct, you know, um, and I'm getting goosebumps just thinking yeah. about it, you know, so yeah, um, no, I'm pretty cool, I'm pretty excited about it, I've never been here before, so yeah, yeah first time. Time. Yeah. He's definitely going to be vulnerable tonight, aren't you? <laughs> Cheers, thanks, guys. <laughs> I've said it before, I've been sceptical about like stories like we've just told, you know. But in this case, there's two of us that seen the same thing. Mm. And we've never even spoken, haven't we? No. Because we, I was in here from the interview, no. you were outside. Yeah, we're so we, we've both seen it separately and yeah. not even spoken about it, so. Yeah. yeah. Have you scratched your neck? No. Just turn, turn that light on. You are insanely red. Oh, give over, give no, over. Mate, no, 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 mirror. no, no, yeah, yeah. Mirror, I promise you, come look at this mirror. Have you been rubbing it? No, not at all, not at no, all. I ain't seen you touch it. Come look at this mirror, mate, oh, honestly. Oh, come on. Yeah. Sorry, no, 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 no
Oh, I do, yeah. I do. Yeah. Look at that. You got it the other side. You got it the other side? No. 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 Right. Like what? Are you sure you've not touched it? No, 100%. 100%. Look at that. It's white now. Yeah, it's weird, that. Mm. It's like something's been rubbing on your neck, or. Yeah. Well, that's you great. You felt anything? Or? No, nothing. Nothing yeah. at all. Nothing at all. Yeah. I mean, maybe I've done it Probably. by accident. Yeah, that's quite good. thinking, though. yeah. Mm. So I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, guys, it's a good start yeah. tonight. Eh? Well, guys, I'm really, yeah, I'm really hoping that together we can yeah. Yeah. get some really good evidence in this place tonight, and I'm really looking forward to working with you yeah. again because it's been far too long. We tried yeah, to arrange something for a while, and it's just <laughs> so I'm really. I glad think we, we did actually it. try and plan one, didn't we? And yeah, it we got cancelled because of COVID. Yeah, all, yeah, all that oh, kicked yeah. off. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Anyway, You're good luck, guys. Great. Good luck. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah, good luck, and we'll catch up with you shortly. All right. And I'll leave. I'll leave all your links in the description. Yeah, thank you, and you too. And obviously, we'll let you two. Have the place to yourselves for a little bit. Yeah. We're going to get some food, so anything that happens, yeah, you let us know. Yeah. All right, see you later. Good luck, good luck. <laughs> All right, me and David are hey? heading into the bishop's room. Yeah, we have to do the. Uh... You can't just walk in here, you've got to knock. <laughs> this place back brings back memories. Yeah. Right guys, me and David have come up to start our nighttime investigation in the bishop's room. Uh, this is a place that holds a lot of dark energy. So going way back um, when the original owner used to live here they used to have strange people come in here uh, to stay the night and they did have a lot of satanists come in this room specifically and the beds that are here now the original ones with the original quilts they used to be free didn't they That's right. um, and they used to have all stab marks in them knife stab marks um, from these I know Satanists, Satanic calls used to come here. Um, also, this room, I believe, from what I've read, has had multiple exorcisms um, trying to rid the dark energy that's supposed to be in here. Now, this entire place is built on top of a 5,000 year old pagan burial ground. And downstairs, where we filmed the intro and got those few EVPs, they actually had these weird lumps come up on the floor back in the day um, and they had it all scanned started digging and they found the bodies of children didn't they which along with their bodies were like knives and stuff like that on it so they, f they believed that they were like either killed through ritual killings or part of this pagan burial ground that's underneath but um yeah a lot of dark stuff a lot of strange stuff supposed to happen here and this room specifically is said to be one of the most haunted rooms in the ancient ramen this is where everything happened with my mom uh, and yeah we've had a lot of weird stuff happen here so be interesting to see what we get tonight yeah <clears throat> exactly i had a bad experience in this chair Sort yeah. of like, sort of tried to take me over, but I managed to get over it. Um, How do you feel being back in here? Uh, I feel a bit weird. I'm in the same chair, but I'm not bothered about that. Yeah. So we'll do um, loads of experiments, different spirit box, yeah, EVPs, and etc. And we'll have a good, um, a good session in here. Right, I'm going to turn our app on Spirit Talker. If you want to check this out, there's links in the description, both on iOS and Android. I'm going to run this now in here and see if we get any intelligent responses. Is there anybody with me and David? If so, can you come forward?
Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Oh. Holy Spirit. Now, sure. this place was connected to the church. Yeah. The church were the original owners of the ancient Ramen. Um, and there's supposed to be a secret tunnel that leads to the local church underneath. But it could also be something dark pretending to be holy. Oh, we're trying to trick us. So... Did you hear that? What? Like a thud. Are you over there? Doing floorboards. Can you make a noise for us? The device here in my hand, you can choose words, phrases, or sentences to talk. Please wait and listen. Okay. Okay. Please wait and listen. We're waiting. Can you rattle one of the doors? I feel like whatever's in here um, is... Do you believe in us? Yes. we do. Yes. We do believe in you. That's why we're here. Please show us that you're here. Come and touch my hand now. Make the lights go for me. On this device here, the green light. All you got to do is come to me, touch my hand. We don't need any evidence to prove that you're real. We fully believe in the afterlife. We fully believe that there's something else after life. But there's a lot of people around the world and a lot of people that will watch this that we're documenting now who won't believe you and will think that you don't exist, will think that this is a load of rubbish. And we want you to just do something, not for us, but for all the other people that will watch this that don't believe can you do something for them yeah yeah Matt. thank you we enjoy the company look you enjoy the company have thank you been you. filming it thank you yeah i'm filming it yeah. right so we've got k2 spikes now thank you thanks very much for that you see? And we enjoy being in your company. Is there anything else you can do for people at home watching this? Could you possibly say something or make a noise of your voice? Move something? Throw something? Uh, tap on a door, knock on a door, anything. Mum. David, he's mm. just said mum. Yeah, your mum. What if he's on the back of my mum? Yeah. Do you know what happened to my mum? 
because it happened right here right on this bed and it said mum as you said it yeah not mum do you remember that happening It's definitely quiet. Yeah. That's not normal. If you're here with us, the device in my hand will pick up your voice. All you need to do is stand beside it and talk directly into it for me. Do you remember me and David? Who roams this room? Can you tell me why so many people experience negative things here? If there's something you want to say to us right now, can you say it into this? Right, should we see what's on it? Yeah. If you hear the the device in my hand will pick up your voice. What you need to do? Stand beside it and talk directly into it for me. Do you remember me and David? Who oh. in this room? Oh, Can you tell me why so many people experience negative things here? Something... Oh, David, that's oh. a growl. Can you tell me why so many people experience negative things here? If that was you, if you were just shouting, do you not like me and David being here? What do you want to say to us? What message do you have? What happened on this bed? Yes. What happened on this bed? 
What did that just say? What happened on this bed? <gasps> what happened on this bed? <gasps> Possession. Possession! Did you hear it say yeah, that? Yeah. Oh sh I need to ask one more question. Yes, you're right. A possession did happen on this bed. Were you involved? Was it something demonic? Is whatever it was still here? Is it stopping you from communicating? Let's just see if he's out on that. What the sh is that? Oh, the whisper. I was there. I was there. Oh, oh, David, 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 David. One minute, wait, wait. I've got to sort myself out, mate. Just, yeah, no, just give me a minute. I've got, I just think it because I've, I've got goosebumps on my back. That is one of the clearest whispers I've ever caught on this. That's clear as day, it goes, I was there. And the fact to say what happened on this bed, possession, and I was there. So whatever, whatever's in the room with us now, it knows who we are and it witnessed what happened. So is this a spirit that was just there and witnessed it or is it the one that flipping did it that's what we need to figure out because if it's the thing that did it then we're we could be in a bit of trouble are you in this room dave. it's me why is it dave oh my chest is on really tight Step back from Tom. Oh. oh, I've got this tightness in my chest. Pain on the right hand side. And just a bit, I, I don't know what that is. I can't see anything, David. I can't see anything. I don't even know where I am. It's that flipping dark in here. Chest gone really tight and... Other. Yeah, that's weird. We're gonna need a bit of, I think we need to get out of it. A bit of fresh air. Right, so me and David's come into the barn area, another very active location um, at the ancient ram in. What we're going to do, we're set up here on the table. We've got a REM pod, which I'm going to set up in a minute, K2 meter spirit box. The K2 meter is now starting to flicker. Can you see that? Yeah. So um, yeah, we've got the EVP recorder. Uh, we're going to be running the app as well. 
Um, but I've got a new piece of equipment, um, which is this. It's basically like a mini LiDAR type device. Now what it does is, when plugged in, it will scan the area and anything in front of it within, anything within 2.5 meters of the camera lens, it will 3D map them in. Now things that are far away are gonna be blue and they start to change to red the closer they get towards the camera. So what I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna film with my phone the screen of this because it doesn't record so I'm going to be filming scanning around with this obviously if we capture anything we're going to have that documented on my phone camera David's running the night vision camera we've also got a wide shot of the full spectrum camera which you can see now um, so I'm going to start scanning with this and I think what should we do to start calling out first and see if yeah. we get any interactions out it. so um plug this in so as you can see um, as I'm scanning this it's flashing you can see that it sends out infrared signals and you can see it mapping David and if I was to move closer towards David he'll start to change colour see that can you show yourself Can you step towards the table? Right, I think. Right, everything. What the hell? What the hell was that? What the hell was that? Who is that? Do it again. Copy me. Point the camera over there. Ah. See if you can see anything over there. All side of the camera over there. Can you do something? Make a noise. Can you knock? Is there anybody here? Would like to come forward? Talk to us? Potentially. Potentially. So you, who's that? You're coming. You're on the Potentially. Potentially. So you, who's that? You're coming. You're on the way. What was that then? You hear someone walk past there then? Yeah. Someone just walked past. Ben? Ben? They're upstairs. Opening curtains have come in. Through the flipper, what past the Did you hear the footsteps? Yeah, it's just outside. Is anyone behind the curtain? Yeah, it's us. Have you just walked past the curtain? We've not walked past the curtain at all, no. You, nobody's walked in the room in between? No, mate, no. We're just in here, but next to the grave. Okay. Did you hear someone walk past? It sounded like yeah. somebody walking on concrete. I did, yeah. It's very quiet in here. Um, don't seem to be much going down. The um, we definitely heard footsteps, like somebody walking on concrete, 
um, the other side of the curtain. Can you come towards this box here? Say hello. Who's here with us? Priest. Priest. Hear Wait. that? Wait. Priest. Manifest. Yeah, please. Show us what you look like. Cross. 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 Hey? Cross. Priest. Cross. 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 Well, this cross. You bought a cross. Oh. Good and evil here. Good and evil here. I got a cross. Evil. It just said evil through there. Yeah. What year were you here? Did you hear that? I thought it said 1600. I didn't hear it, I missed that. What's that just said? That said there's more of us. Okay. Which makes sense. Yeah. Because, as I said earlier, the, uh, the church used to own this building. Could this be the main part of the church? No, they owned, this was their, where they... Oh, they used to live? Yeah, and they also, um, they housed slaves here. The church did. Yeah. We're here. We know you're here. Can you try and come a bit closer? Use your energy to manipulate this box here. Let's try and have a conversation. Can you move location? Where to? Did you hear what that said? Where's Gary? You said, where do you want us to move? It said, Gary. No. I'm, sh I'm sure, I'm sure one of the guys is called Gary. Where's Gary now? What uh, area? Gary. No, that's Gary with the glasses on, isn't it? I think so, yeah. Well, and he's on. Y yeah, so where's, he wants us to go wherever he is. We've definitely had some like intelligent responses on that spirit box um, and the app as well. They at one point seemed to correspond with each other, which is weird. Um, we do know that there were connections to the priests and the church. Um, the church were actually owners of this building uh, going way back. Um, and it said that they house slaves here. Um, at one point, I do believe the priests were here. And when we asked what year, the spirit box clear as day said 1600s. So I need to look into that, you know. Yeah. See if there were priests, if we can find if there were priests here in 1600s and make it more compelling. But then it's a move location. And you said, where do you want us to move? And it said, Gary. Right. So wherever he's been is where he wants us to go for some reason. That's which is, I thought that was weird. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Elmer, hey, come and sit with me. Can you take all the lights? Do two lights for me. Please. Here we go. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Freeze. Thank you. Freeze. Freeze. Two lights. Thank you. Now, do you think we could go three lights? See how we go. Three so lights. Know, three lights. You asked for three, didn't you? Yeah. Can you do them all now? All four? That's it. Start from there. Flash your you lights. You've helped me. Oh, we can help you if you want. You've helped me. 
So we've already helped them, have we? Have we? Oh, right. So I thought it says you can help me. You've helped me. Have we helped you? Because we've spoken to you. I just want to say, ask that then as yeah. Is it Cosmo Speaker? Whoa. What's that? That was your REM near the door. Was it? Yeah. yeah. Is that going off? Yeah. Yeah, our REM pod's going off by the door. Thought like he needs our help. Someone's touching that over there. Yeah. Are you touching that device over on the barrel? Yeah. You like these devices? They let us know where you're here. Yeah. Come back and join us over at this REM pod. Make that one. Come back over here. Make that REM pod light up. Come back and join us. Come and sit with me. Come join Dave. I'll help you if you can. If I can. Is anybody with you? Is it still going off? Yeah. yeah it's still going off, yeah. Good spirits here. That's good. Oh, that's good. That's great. Yeah, how many? What spirits have you had about for? Because it was a boat. It was a in in. Would you come and do this one, please? Did you have about? Whoa. Whoa, they're both going off. Thanks. Yeah, ours is going off and yours is going off. Can you go uh, Hold on to it. We're moving around. We're moving around. Whoa. Okay. Okay. But but whereabouts around. are you now? It's obviously moving from. Yeah, moving around, yeah. Here to over there. That's <laughs> going off, isn't it? That's class, that way. I'll, I'll get, get you. Fool. Fool, 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 fool. Can you name the person who you want to get? Adam. Elmo, can you just stop that one over we there for a minute? Power. We have Reset power. it. Power. If you've got power, then show us. Because the moment you're making that thing light up. Let's bang a wall. Come and show us your power. Come on. Whoa. It's holding on to it a lot. Mm. When you said that. Yeah. Show us your power. I can't see it. Come on. Is it on the floor? It's got that chilly there, man. Did you, did you say um, who are you going to kill or something? No, I said who are you going to get? Yeah. Yeah, and then on my I was on, an, on an app, he went you. Weird when you said... Uh, there you go. There you, go. you come back Leave. shit with me. Leave. 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 Oh, oh yeah. no, I'm leaving, yeah. You can't do that. Are you making my back really cold? We're just having fun. It did just get colder. I yeah. felt it got colder. The children are heard. The children are heard. Could well be children, you know. Yeah, it's. Because well, that one's obviously next children. to that children's grave. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Mm. I was going to say, it was weird though earlier when you said, like, come on, use your power, and that one just like, it's like someone held on yeah, to it. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Just went off, didn't it? I'm listening to everything. And okay. there you are. Wait to answer than listen. Are you still? Here we go. There we go. Uh, Thank you. You know, um, three lights for me.
Left, turn it off. Hey. Sorry, turn it off. What's up? Shh. Someone's tapping over there. What's that? Whoa. What is it? Someone's over there. Have you just turned our camera off? There was loads of movement over there in that corner. Yeah, yeah. Ben, 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 said his, ben said on the ring he's lost yeah, picture. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Where's that reader? I wonder if they just turned the camera off. What's that light well, from? What light? I can uh, hear you now, but I can't see you. There was, there was like, what the hell? Someone's messed with the camera. That's where it's coming yeah. from. It sounded like someone was tapping on something and then... Then he said they lost picture. Did you hear the, like, the cracking noise as well? Yes, yeah. yes. That was weird, that. Sorry, Let me get the camera over here. That's really unusual. What's, What's that? happened? It's, 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 it's turned off. The battery's okay. And then he went to turn it back on. It right, turned right, itself off again. Very strange. Camera's near that grave as well, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I went and read this with a gauss reader at, at Spike at 10. Around the camera. Here we go. Followers left. Followers left. What? Whoa. Here we go. Do you have a name? John. John. Oh. Nice. John. John Humphreys. John Humphreys. Are you John Humphreys? It said John in the bar, yeah. the bar as well. Yeah. John. John, yes, John. Yeah, John. Yes, John. Yeah, John. John, can you please tell us your nickname? Rambo. Rambo. Are you a Are you a Did you say Yeah. yeah. Uh, John. John. John again. Right, guys, we're going to end the video there. I'm filming this a couple of days after the investigation because once again, we completely forgot to film an outro. But what a crazy night! Like, um, that place, it's just got this weird energy about it. And like I said at the beginning of the video, like, I had a strange feeling and just goosebumps, even just walking towards the place and knowing that we we're going back there just gave me the creeps as well. Um, so yeah, it's just one of them places, one of them places that always stick in my mind for what happened back in the day with my mom and stuff. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, we did capture some strange EVPs and some good spirit box and a lot of good um, intelligent responses on the app as well. But yeah, let me know what you thought to the investigation. Lots more coming up. Uh, we've also got more haunted forests coming up, which I'm looking forward to. Um, and obviously it's spooky season. It's October, my favorite time of the year. So we're going to be pumping out more videos this month for you guys as well. And again, sorry for the delay. Uh, just a lot going off um, at home and stuff and a lot going off in my personal life. Um, why has been lack of videos. But uh, back at it now, back investigating. And we shall see you guys on the next paranormal adventure and because david's not here with me may you live long and die old long <laughs>